voluntarily. And when you stress, you tend to forget that you can also activate these systems voluntarily. This is an extremely powerful set of techniques that are very, very useful for reducing your stress response in real time. And here's how they work. So if you want to calm down quickly, you need to make your exhales longer and or more vigorous than your inhales. Now, the reason your immune system, I know that might be a tough pill to swallow, but it's absolutely true. In fact, stress often comes in the form of bacterial or viral infection. And the stress response is in part organized to combat bacterial and viral infection. There are pathways from the same brain centers that activate these uh, neurons in your, in your spinal cord to make you feel like you want to move. There are other neurons in your brain that activate things like your spleen, which will deploy killer cells to go out and scavenge for incoming bacteria and viruses and try and eat them up and kill them. of the pupils, the changes in the optics of the eyes, the quickening of the heart rate, the sharpening of your cognition. And in fact, that short-term stress brings certain elements of the brain online that allow you to focus. Now it narrows your focus. You're not good at seeing the so-called big picture, but it narrows your focus. It allows you to do these, what I call duration path outcome types of analysis. It allows you to evaluate your environment, evaluate what you need to do. It primes your whole system for better cognition. It primes your immune system to combat infection. And that all makes sense when you think about the fact that famine, Wim Hof breathing. Now Wim Hof breathing is so named after the so-called Iceman, Wim Hof. There are two components to a sort of breathing protocol that he developed that was based also on what's called TUMO breathing, T-U-M-M-O. So before Wim, there was TUMO breathing. Many people call this now super oxygenation breathing. What I'm talking about here, regardless of whether or not it's called Wim Hof, TUMO, or super oxygenation, is rapid, deliberate breathing. So it's deliberate hyperventilation. Why would somebody want to do this? Well, presented that can allow you to adjust and modulate your internal levels of alertness or calmness so that you can lean more effectively into life, which includes sleep and social connection and the work you have to do 